Hi, so today we're going to be doing some curry chicken. And uh, so we'll start out with our ingredients as we usually do. We have the uh, drumsticks and the uh, chicken thigh. And moving on to the vegetables here, we have the, uh, we have the potatoes and the carrots, bell peppers, some purple onion, some garlic, some black pepper, and the curry seasoning. And then we have um, the pineapple, and this is uh, coconut milk. And we have a little bit of the Date Puti fish sauce. And I keep stressing Date Puti. It is my favorite, most consistent. I'm gonna actually fry the carrots and the potatoes. And you may ask why? Why, why not just put them in, uh, cook them in the conventional way? We do it because it, uh, it remains consistent. It doesn't fall apart or disintegrate when we're starting to add it into the rest of the meal. So it's very important uh, for us that we do it that way. It may not be the most healthy way, but it certainly uh, keeps things intact and the flavor is unbelievable. So we're going to start now. Okay, I'm going to put a little oil in the, um, in the pan. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to add the um, purple onion in here. Okay. And then we're going to add garlic. Mix everything in. Make sure you get enough oil in there. And make sure you have it on a medium heat so you don't burn anything up. You want to cook it at a medium pace, if you will. See that we're sauteed pretty much everything, just about anyway. And now next we're going to go ahead and we're going to put the, um, the curry powder in, okay? And just kind of spread it around equally. Okay. okay, so you can see, take a look inside the pan here. We have everything um, stir, um, sauteed and we added the curry. And now we're going to add the, um, the chicken, guys, okay? Now, look at this. Is this a thing of beauty right here? Look, wonderful. So you can see the coloring, which is um, is the curry, obviously, and the browning of the chicken. I'm just going to add some of the, the black pepper in here. Okay, so you can see the uh, potato and carrots, how we fried them and how they're um, a little more rigid, if you will. Very tasty and well cooked, but yet rigid. So um, as they're being stewed, if you will, with the rest of the chicken, they won't come apart and become mashed potatoes and mashed carrots. So we're just gonna, uh-oh, there goes one. And we're gonna go all around. And we're gonna stir that in slowly. Hi guys, all right, so um, take a look. We're, uh, we're doing well here, we're, we're nearly completed. So now we're gonna add some of the last few things here, some bell pepper. And then, okay, so we're gonna add the pineapple now. And this pineapple, Gives it a really nice flavor when it's all mixed together like this. We're gonna mix it in and um, we're gonna uh, further uh, stew it a bit, okay? And we'll be back shortly with the um, the plating. Thanks, guys. Hello, and uh, this is it. This is the uh, curry chicken we spoke of. Uh, thank you so much for uh, for staying with us on this particular journey of cooking the uh, the curry chicken. You can like uh, and share our, our, our posts and and, um, and subscribe if you'd be. Uh, willing. We love that. Thank you so much, guys.